So we've got a leak here at the rear servo cover gasket. To start off with, just to uh, create a bit more access to it, we're just going to lower the or take these bolts off the cross member, give it a good clean. We've taken the speedo speedo cable off because it comes right across in front of there. Now I've got a lot more access there. So we'll just give that a wire brush around and blow out. Leave two loose and then take the other ones off. Just going to support the servo while we're taking these two bolts off. And we're going to slowly take it out just so the piston doesn't fly out. the gasket was all broken. Given it a good clean and we're just going to make sure that the servo piston hasn't worn a groove or a step in the housing. Now we've just put some Vaseline in there when we've been putting the piston back on so the seals don't run dry and we're just going to put some Vaseline in there so when we put the pin in it's easier to put back in and you can see where that pin pushes on the band. Spring in and the gasket will hold two bolts either side. Put it in, made sure the pin's in that hole and we've just put the these two bolts, just a couple of threads in and we're just going to make sure there's a bit of detent or springingness sure that we do it up evenly. We're just going to put the speedo cable back on, out in there, just making sure the truck's falling in. Putting the cross member bolts back on. Put the cross member back on, we've put this uh, servo back on, speedo cable back on, just make sure that you double check all your work and now we're just going to top it up with oil. It's done and thank you for watching.